Welcome back. I am Hemi the local pizza chef around here. Today you'll be helping me cook with fractional parts. First order up. I made two whole pizzas. I cut the first one into thirds and the second into fourths. If a customer was really hungry, from which pizza should I serve them a slice? The pizza cut into four smaller slices where each slice equals one fourth, or from the pizza cut into thirds where each slice equals one third. That's right. I should give the customer a slice from the pizza cut into thirds because one third is larger than one fourth. The more slices or fractional parts there are, the smaller the slice or fraction will be. If we have fewer slices, the fraction and slices will be larger. All right, next order. The customers want two pizzas, each cut into sixths. When naming a fraction beyond or more than one whole, we look at one figure, one pizza in our case, to name the fraction. Because both of these pizzas are cut into sixths, we can say that these two pizzas are partitioned into sixths. Let's count to see how many sixths we have in total. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We have 12 sixths in total. We're done with orders for now. Great job today helping me count fractional parts, even fractional parts beyond one whole. I'll see you next time.